Billy Cosby, y'all. And how are you doing today? I hope you're having a fantastic day. I hope everything in your world is going as good as it is in my world. There's only one way to make the day feel a little bit better. That's with a beer. So I was reading the news earlier today and uh, I saw that our great president, Donald Trump, he invited himself to throw the ball at the Yankee game and I fucking feel like he should be able to throw the goddamn ball at the Yankee game. He is the president of this great United States. Nothing better than taking down a few of these here every day. Well, you know, sometimes I take down 12, sometimes I take down 24. Really, it's all a challenge to myself. I've never seen a man in such great physical condition as your president, as my president. A few motherfuckers feel like he shouldn't throw the pitch. Now, I love everything about him. Some people don't like the way he feels about other people. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm an African American, and I'm not going to lie to you. They let that dark bastard 50 cents throw the pitch. They let that darky Barack Obama throw the pitch. Everybody throw the pitch, but they just happen to have a problem with your greatest president that, the, that God has ever given to you. It's like my dad used to say, you can only trust somebody as far as you could throw them. What I'm trying to say is, Donald Trump's gotta be lighter than a feather. He might seem like he's really fat, but actually he is a sweet, gentle, soft man. So the only other person that I've ever encountered in my life that is almost as equally as perfect in every way than the greatest president, Donald Trump, the 45th president, is my father, No Emotion Gold Mask. I know that a lot of people disagree with the way that he might say things, but who else would you like to run your country? Somebody that's not gonna say what's on their fucking mind? Now that soft-spoken last guy, that Obama, that old, you know, related to Ben Sama guy, he would never say what's on his mind. He had too many people worry about it. You know how it is sometimes when you're one of those black women, you're not able to just say whatever. Like my woman, you know, I'm gonna call her a bitch whenever I want. Don't you want somebody to defend you the way that you deserve to be defended? And then another thing, I like the way that our president is raising his kids. He raises children the way that a child is supposed to be raised. You should never beat your kids. You should never actually punish them. Speak to them in a very soft tone. Timothy, don't do that, please. Stop. Don't bite your sister. Jonathan. Don't go in the swimming pool. But a lot of these black fillers aren't allowed to talk to their women these ways. Our president deserves to throw that goddamn ball. It's like my daddy used to say. When you're in charge, nobody else can tell your dumb ass what to do. Thanks for watching the video. Help us write songs. Join the live stream every day on YouTube at 6 o'clock. We go hard, we keep it tight.